Labor Day is a day that celebrates the economic and social contributions of workers. And this year, many people had to celebrate while knowing that they didn't even have a job. Good evening, I'm Laura Emerson. Sean Higarty is off tonight. With the national unemployment rate holding steady at 9.1%, where are the jobs? Fox Toledo's Jennifer Steck joins us live with a breakdown of the latest unemployment numbers. Well, where some industries have seen an increase in jobs, others have been seeing a decrease, creating a sort of stalemate in the workforce. At a time millions of Americans need a job, employers are playing a hiring waiting game. On this Labor Day, 14 million Americans are currently unemployed. The people who have jobs now should be very grateful for the fact that they have managed to avoid the layoffs that a lot of their peers have gone, had to go through. According to the U.S. Bureau of Labor, 6 million Americans have been jobless for 27 weeks or longer, and nearly 1 million workers are considered to be discouraged workers, meaning they've given up on the job search and are not counted as unemployed. By any means, if you lose 700 jobs, you, know, you need 1,000 jobs to replace it, and we haven't seen that. But we are seeing companies hiring two, three, four, five people. Um, it is picking up, and it has been steady, but it's just, you know, when you've got as many people out of work as we do in this area, it makes it very difficult to get those people back up to speed and back into the job force. Traditionally, Toledo is two steps behind when it comes to economic progress. But this time, the Toledo trends on job loss and growth match the national trends. Still, as a whole, the country, Toledo included, continues to play a waiting game on when is a good time to hire. I think there's a lot of opportunity out there for growth. We're, it's just a, everyone's kind of in the wait and see mode, and, and they're trying to figure out what everyone else is going to do before they really make the jump. <laughs> Well, they say, said Toledo is one job announcement away from a break that people need, and it could come from the industry that has powered the city for generations, the auto industry. However, they says one area you can count on to find jobs, health care. Hiring in that industry remains at a steady pace. Reporting tonight, Jennifer Steck, Fox Toledo News.